The tank buddy. Ready for this? Okay, okay, okay. See, see, see. Oh, here we go. Let's go, let's go. Oh, oh, oh. And it worked. See? The tank buddy. Hey, what's up, guys? Um, today, I'm going to be uh, showing you how to uh, build the tank buddy. It is um, the an automatic tank feeder built completely out of um, the LEGO EV3 core and expansion education set from Lego Mindstorms um, built and designed and built by the Shadow Hills Falcons bots and today I'm showing you how to build it so um, uh, this video isn't supposed to be an exact exact tutorial but it, it I mean if you want to copy exactly go ahead but um, it's I this video, like a lot of um, videos, have has been recorded and reversed from instead of being built up, it's actually been taken apart in reverse. And this is actually me um, taking it apart. Um, right now, I'm just um, building the EV3 brick to so then it can attach to a your pet's tank. It doesn't, well, this obviously doesn't fit for all sizes yet, but, um, th this is basically a general idea of if you have a pet and you have problems feeding it, the, we built the tank buddies so then you could, um, help feed your pet, um, depending what kind of animal you have. As a pet, it could feed up to six days if you, it only has to be fed once a day. It has to be fed twice a day, it can be fed for three days, and so on. It has six different um, compartments to be filled, and this is part one of a two-part video. And this is just, right now, I'm building the hook, which will allow the EV3 brick to um, hang onto your tank. So the top of your tank will have to have an opening, and... Yeah, th this was, we were trying to be friendly, we, this is actually our second version as you could tell by the beginning of the video, and this time we tried to be a bit more friendly to people trying to build their own, and this is what we're trying to do, inspire others to um, build f you know, automatic pet feeders. It works well with pellet based foods for animals, like betta fish. Beta fishes are a good one because um, you can just feed them once a day, only a few pellets. So that, that's a really, the tank buddy is really good for that. And right now, um, this is a new part. I should have probably clarified that. And now I'm going to build um, the motor that will, uh, mo that helps, uh, Build the tank buddy, move it, and yeah. As I said, this will be a two part video, so a lot of this won't make sense and it won't go together. And this is just the basic part. The more complicated part will be come in the second part of the video. And yeah. And sorry for my voice, I'm kind of sick, but anyway. Right now, you're using a medium motor. There are a few slip-ups. I think there's already been one, if not, where it makes the video look really weird due to it being in reverse. But that's okay as long as you guys can kind of figure out how this is built and how to build it. It's That's all that matters. Um, the goal of Shadow Hills Falcon Bots with this is... Um, see, a lot of people have pets, and a lot of people forget to feed their pets constantly, so, and that's not a good thing, because pets can die without a few days, sometimes, depending what kind of pet it is. As I said, this works with small pets in tanks. Um, well, when I think about it now, this is a really big feeder for small well I mean not big feeder but the tank it attaches to 
is really big for small pets, but, you know, I mean, if you get a big tank, your pet will have more room, but, yeah, we're trying to help pet owners and pets out because the theme of this year's FL, you know, first Lego League um, is animals, and we were thinking of a problem and a solution. A problem was feeding pets. Lots of people have to hire others or just don't feed them sometimes when they have to go or they just, you know, just forget. And we're just here trying to about, I mean, we, we've um, already shared this idea with a few people and actually some, well, there, there was a person who thought maybe this could have been you know, something we, we could have, like, shown to companies, but that's not really our goal here. It's just to help out the animals, and this is just um, our project for the first LEGO League competition, and, yeah, I'm not very good at commentaries and stuff, but here I'm just trying to help explain. I'm sorry if the video is a little hard to understand. You can pause it if you want, but, you know, as I said, you don't have to build this exactly. Lego, be creative. But yeah, um, I'm still building the first part here, even though it's at twice the speed. This video is gonna be very long, but that's fine. Anyway, that wheel there, um, that I just placed actually doesn't need to be there at all. You could place anything else, really. You don't even have to place anything. It's just there, so then, um, you know, the two parts don't push up against each other in the gap. Some places, for some reason, I block the gaps. Other places, I didn't care at all. But it's fine, you know. As I said, and I'm going to keep saying, it doesn't have to be exactly like ours. It's not going to be exactly like ours. Our tank's different size than yours, so... Yours can end up looking something completely different if you're planning to build a automatic tank feeder for your pet out of Legos. So you, I mean, you don't have to build out of Legos, but yeah, as you can tell, um, I'm using I was using an EV3 brick earlier. You you could do this with NXT, but um, another important thing which I'll get to in the next video actually but so um, actually I, I'm not gonna include that here so never mind um, <sighs> these parts aren't really gonna go together that well when this is all done and um, so you're not gonna really understand it yet but this next part of the video as you can tell by the transition oh there was a slip up but anyway this next part um, is actually the part before except in like um, basically inverted so if you know how to build things like a mirror like if you build something then you can build a mirror copy kinda it's like mir mirrors are weird it's like seeing the exact same except opposite at the same time but anyway this is like a mirror copy of that second part that we built it's another medium motor and there's not much um, you know, it's the same thing, except the other way around, like a mirror. And, well, the thing about this is, if you're really, another thing I'm thinking, if you're really planning to use something like this constantly for your pet, you would have to be charging it constantly, due to the fact that it would have to be on the whole time. Anyway, um... Right now, it's just building again, and I believe there's an, one more slip-up, but that's fine. It's not like I'm trying to hide the fact that this video is the where actually me taking them apart and reversing them, so it doesn't really matter. I just think it looks funny, you know? As I said before, I'm not the best at commentary, so I'm sorry if you get bored, well, but you know... Most likely, if you're trying to build this, you might end up pausing this, like I end up doing with a lot of tutorials. And um, at the at the end, um, well, I'm lost for words. Yeah, you know, there, there's nothing really there. It's just 
this, and that's fine. That's okay. Anyway, as you can see, my friend was over there messing around. He, he, he's also on the team, the Shadows Falcon Bots. Um, he was messing with, what is it? Needle? That um, one artist eraser thing that's like clay. I used to have, I used to have a bunch of that when I was in sixth grade. But yeah, as you can see again, I put that wheel in. If you don't have those, which I think you should, if you have the sets, but that's fine. And well, if you only have like one, I haven't actually checked if it only requires one core and expansion set. So if you only have one and say at home, I'm kind of sorry if it it doesn't cover that. But yeah. Um, and also, I'm kind of sorry that it was kind of dark earlier in the video. The lights were actually, um, off. And I was just doing this off my, um, own phone's light. light. And, yeah, right now we're about to come to an end. So, um, if you'd like to see how to build the rest of this, um... You can find that out in part two of the building the tank buddy, or whatever this video is going to be called. Who knows? And um, I am a member of the Shadows Falcon Bots, and thank you for watching this video. I hope I helped you and your pet today. Peace out.